one by Lee. And he lands a nice kick. I can Slugfest with more often than not, you end up twitching on the canvas, concussed. You're playing with fire here if you choose to stand and trade on a napkin in the center of the octagon with this guy. This guy has ridiculously powerful kicks. This is the one thing his opponent needs to absolutely avoid if he hopes to achieve victory in this fight. for this, our main event of the evening. More than a decade separates these two fighters when it comes to the age, with big differences in height and reach. Here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge of the Octagon, Dan Mergliata. And now, this is the moment It's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. It's fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon! And now, introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a grappler, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet six inches tall, weighing in at 265 pounds. Fighting out of Lakewood, Colorado, USA, El Terrible. All right, here's the rules of the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. I want a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, go back to your corners, come out fighting. I am very fired up for this fight. It's been a long time coming. The fans have been anticipating this for a long time, and it is going to go Let's down go. right now. Nice leg kick. Very nice. Ah, uh, he's unable to connect with the left hook, Joe. Whiffs on the straight right hand. Oh, that hook has been there all night. There's another one by Lee. And he lands a nice kick. High kick! Whoa! He hurt him! He is rocked! Oh, look at this! Who saw that coming? Heard him with that spinning back first.
under three minutes now to go in what has been a very fast-paced opening round here. Oh, straight right. Nice leg kick. Wow. How about that shin? Throwing that jab, no good. Yeah, and here he goes again. Single leg takedown. Oh, worked hard to get up again, but he looks like he's compromised. Oh, nice kick. Just misses with the straight right. He's fainting with the punch. Finds his range with the jab. Strong defense there to block the shot. That one hurt. Oh, that's a good strike there by Lee. Spinning back fist is there. Good defense there. Caught him with a punch. Big hook. That cut on his cheek is getting worse. He's looking to pass. Splits the guard, lands the right hand. He's posturing up here. Round two straight ahead. That's the end of the round, and this cut on the cheek, Joe, could be a factor moving forward. Certainly better to have the cut below the eye than above it, but the cut man's now got to get in there, shut that thing, and prevent it from being a major factor now moving forward. Here's a perfect head kick. Here's a devastating kick that does some serious damage. And here's a huge, perfectly placed punch that lands with devastating impact. Ariane Celeste on hand. All right, here we go with round two. That last round was absolutely insane. Both guys got rocked. If they continue at that pace, someone's going to sleep in this round. Oh, going to the head kick, now it's there. Well, he's landed some excellent shots in this fight tonight, but more often than not, it has been one and done. So the emphasis now moving forward, combinations. Throw your punches in bunches and really try to force the issue and get your opponent out of there. Oh, he left his head wide open to absorb that straight hand. He has shown a vulnerability here by leaning in right into his opponent's range. Just misses with the straight left hand. And he's got the single leg takedown. Full guard now. Lee gets caught with that punch. His chin is held up thus far. Got to shore up the defense here, though. Trying to mount. He's got it. Full mount. He's got full. Oh, nope. Half guard. He moves into side control. Working from the mounted crucifix. Excellent movement here on the ground. Side control again. Just over two minutes to go. Joe doing a nice job here, staying busy from the bottom. Half guard here. Oh, Joe, that cut is getting worse. Rated R looking nasty now. And he is back up to his feet. Changes his stance. So a much different approach for him here in this second round. He was a little bit tentative in round one, a little bit of a feeling out process. Now he has clearly 
found his rhythm, found the range. We'll see if he can continue with more activity here in round two. Big shots being landed on both sides here. Outstanding kick there by Lee. All right, 45 seconds now to go in the round. Punches in bunches, timing perfect. You better play better defense than that. Straight punch. 15 seconds. Oh, effective strike there by Lee. Right, 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 right. sounds on round two. All right, take a seat. Deep breath, man. Breathe. All right, let's get him some water. Take a drink. All right, here we go. Listen, you're doing absolutely awesome. And that's what started everything off, that beautiful jab. And here's another punch that sneaks through. And here's another perfectly placed punch. Jenny Andrade to get us going. Third round underway. Very nice leg kick for him there. Can't take too many of those. Oh, he just continues to land with a high volume of strikes here. Not unlike the previous round, Joe, and at least if his body language is any indication, he is not slowing down whatsoever. Slightly deflected. And he connects there. How about that shin? Oh, both men exchange. We show you the total strikes. And he lands a kick to the leg now. Pretty good work on the feet tonight by Lee. Looking for the left hook. Joe, huge block there. The defense is holding up. Lee's worked in that arm well. Double underhooks now. And he's in the Muay Thai clinch. Over under now, Joe. Under three minutes to go in our third round. Nice punch there by Lee. And from here, transitions to the Muay Thai clinch. Deep breath there and reset. Huge block there. Oh, yeah, looks a little wrong. Big shot to the left. He's stunned. He's hurt. He's trying to stay. Oh, he might be out. He got nailed in the body. He is in big trouble here. Body kick, look at that. Missed with that right hand. Oh, he's really starting to apply pressure on his opponent here. Different approach here in the last couple rounds, and it's the exact sense of urgency that you want to see from a fighter. Take the judges oh, out. He's he's him a little bit. This could be it. Looking for that left. He tagged him again. He's hurt. Whoa! Oh, he's knocked down. Oh, he's out. He's out. He's out. He's out. He threw an incredibly large volume of strikes, but this last one was the big one that landed for the knockout. Yeah, that was just a gorgeous shot to end the fight right there, Joe. Landed flush, and I'm not even sure the opponent really saw it coming. So back to the drawing board for him, but for the winner, this is certainly exactly what he was looking for here tonight. Check it out here. And he's out. Well, what a moment for him here tonight. A huge knockout on one of the sport's biggest stages. That is one they'll be talking about for some time. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Bergliot is going to stop in this contest at 4 minutes, 14 seconds of round number 3. Declaring the winner by...
knockout, Bruce the Dragon Lee. So the legend Bruce Lee does it again. That was a prime performance out of the market.